Today we're going to be breaking down the brand new LEGO Star Wars Rebuild the Galaxy Show trailer, talking about the future of the LEGO Star Wars theme, and also some iconic new characters like Darth Kit Fisto and Prisoner General Grievous. Also, if you want to win a free sealed copy of Jedi Bob Starfighter, I'll be announcing the winner on Monday, and all you have to do to enter is subscribe to the channel and comment down on this video. Strap yourselves in. So because of what I've heard so far, I believe we will be seeing more sets linked to the Rebuild the Galaxy Show in 2025. We already have three brand new August 1st sets based off the show and with just one month until it releases we finally got the full trailer yesterday which clearly takes inspiration from lego's past animated shows like the quest for r2d2 and the freemaker adventures and in case you didn't know some of the greatest lego lore has come from these exact shows like vader being reunited with an n1 starfighter so this show is actually pretty exciting and from what i'm hearing if it's well received it will be the future of the LEGO Star Wars theme. So before we get into all of that, if Jedi Bob Starfighter just isn't quite enough for you, then today's sponsor, The Brick News, do run monthly giveaways of giant UCS sets. You can enter for yourself down at the links in the description, and it really helps to support the channel. So starting things off here, we of course already know that the show will follow our main character, Sig Griebling, who finds the cornerstone and removes it, accidentally creating an entirely alternate galaxy where every person is different and nothing makes sense. But this new trailer gives us a full look at Jedi Bob, who Sig will team up with to change the galaxy back to how it was, and they start by tracking down the heroic Luke Skywalker, but when they get to him, just hanging out in a cantina, he's actually a beach hippie and does not really want to be involved, and we then get an extended montage of action shots from along the journey, which includes a bunch of different Easter eggs, possible future minifigures, and even some actual sets. We see things like an ocean pod race, which is pretty fun, but also the entire Sith Lord lineup, where we can see Darth Kit Fisto, which is probably my favourite part of this new trailer, along with Darth Nubs from the Young Jedi Adventures show, Darth Ray, and also an Ithorian Sith. And it also includes another ugly set, with some kind of gunship or dropship that is able to turn into an ATST, which is pretty weird, but could be a fun set. The most exciting thing we see is prisoner Jedi bounty hunters and senators, with seven characters appearing in Narkina 5 prisoner uniform. This is the prison we see in Andor, where Andy Serkis's character helps to lead a heroic escape. On its own, this is a really cool detail to see and quite an adult reference for a Lego show, but where it gets really exciting is the characters Lego has chosen to put in these Narkina 5 uniforms. There's Yoda, Mace Windu and Luke Skywalker, but also Senator Mon Mothma, Bosk, and General Grievous. That last character is a Deveronian, possibly Labria from the UCS Mos Eisley Cantina. What gives me even more hope for this show is that it is being officially backed by Lucasfilm, and they brought back Mark Hamill and Ahmed Best to voice Beach Luke and Darth Jar Jar. Let me know what you think of this new trailer down in the comments, and of course, don't forget to subscribe for all things LEGO.